that's why I've gotten a lot of like big regional tournaments, but this is my first major on comms. Yeah. It's because I haven't watched enough. Yeah. You're, right. you're Maybe. Like right below the level. Maybe. <laughs> we already saw both Wait, of them just we got We got new text. This is Epoodle and Den. This is not Tash versus Snake anymore. Uh, nope. So not only did you describe a movie wrong, but it's not relevant to the set anymore either. <laughs> Everything goes wrong for me. <laughs> the worst day of my life. <laughs> hey, if this is the worst day of your life, you've got a real good life. That's actually true. <laughs> if the worst day of my life was Supernova, yeah, that's, that's a good day. Yep. Um, that is Den with the BB tag, and E Poodle with just nothing. Rock Black just Marth. Standard Black Marth. Forward smash. Yep. Say this also feels like a matchup where you, like I said, you're getting a lot more of the nickel and dimey kind of neutral. And like punish might be a like I kept you in the air in disadvantage, but it wasn't a straight up a like actual combo. It also is one where scoping out landings because Martha it likes isn't getting back to ground quite as fast. You can get way more of just the up tilt or forward smash, just dump the person off stage and now I'm gonna edge guard. But uh Holy crap, look how fast the stock count swaps. Yeah, this is like uh, like a sharking matchup as opposed to an advantage state matchup where you just have to get underneath them and then hope they uh, they can't land properly or like can't reversal you off of their landing. Mm -hmm. um, looking for that F smash there. That's going to be it. You're not recovering oh, from this. I actually <laughs> really <laughs> like that. We'll still count you know what? that as a four stock, actually. I'm not even going to say that's the JV3 because the, the percent didn't appear on the screen again yet. It was just three stocks with no percent at all. I, I think that counts <laughs> as a four stock chat. <laughs> I, I will count that one. God, that was such a fast game. Yeah, I was actually... I was fully ready when I saw Marth versus slow, Marth to just be like, all right, we're going to... Marth, ditto. Like, not in a, like, oh, this is boring, but like, we're going to lock in. It's going to be this really intricate neutral, and instead it was just a very quick four stock. And I feel like that's kind of emblematic of dittos. Yeah. You're either really good at the ditto or you hate the ditto. There's yep. no in-between. Sometimes you're both. That's I know people true. that hate the ditto and are like, I haven't lost it in three years, but man, I don't enjoy it. Well, second verse, same as the first, seeming yeah. like even on story here. Electronic Poodle is doing some massive work right now. Is that what the E stands for? I I just got to assume. If, if we've got email, that must be what E Poodle is. This is just like electric. It's like it the, the, the cousin of the slide. <laughs> Sliding F smash there. Okay. That's not we're, where I plan to really go with that. We're really trying to transition back to the game. I'm trying to segue, <laughs> man, because the pun was not working. No, it was not. Uh, speaking of segue, the edge guard does not hit. <laughs> um, I'm trying. Speaking of segue, he's on a motorized vehicle to get back to I'm, stage I'm here. Desperately trying to get us back to the game right now. <laughs> All speaking right. Of no, back no, to, no. We just get talk. back to the state. We have to hit the speaking with every time. <laughs> speaking I, of, I hate this. <laughs> oh F wait, smash. yeah, just kind of oh. scopes out the landing. And E Poodle's been doing a phenomenal job of just like I'm gonna keep you out. I'm gonna scope out your landings. Just I don't even need a really edge guard. I can just keep you trapped here. Very reminiscent of like ledge trapping from other games even. Okay, there we go. It might be because I've been watching the Olympics like the last week and a half. Yep. But imagining like two like actual swordsmen like crouching at each other and poking yeah. low like Marth down tilt is hilarious. I mean, you saw the, the, the fancy clip. Fancy yeah. Guy. That's, yeah. That's just mid-level Marth. That's actually just Marth. <laughs> yeah. Down air uh, goes disastrously for E Poodle that time around. Gonna drop another stock, so no four yeah. stock for sure, no three stock either. But in it, this it game. does feel like the like. All right, I, I really closed this out before. I do not need to think. I do not need to not think, but like I don't need to use nearly as much mental energy for game two as long as I win. Yeah, like I, that. Yeah, like the the four stock to two advantage that E Poodle had after like the first minute or so of that game. Mm -hmm. Was also like okay, this is in the bag. Yeah. I just gotta like walk it, walk it through the goalposts. Yep. You're right. I do wish that Olympic fencing had giants floating platforms. <laughs> Actually, yes. that would be that would be. I we could see wave. <laughs> we we need to we life. need to combine world chase tag with fencing and see what happens. Add a little <laughs> bit of rock climbing in there just for uh, for the ledges. Yep, that's just melee. Yeah, I would watch this. I, kind I of as a joke, but I actually would I would watch this at least once for novelty, and then if it turns out it was fun and seemed like a 
good, cool meta, then I would, I would, I would be a fan. I'd buy some jersey or something. It would either be like incredibly boring because people would like yes. camp the ledge. There's got to be real some life. terrible way to play this. Yeah. Um, or it would be like the most insanely hype thing ever, and it's kind of combining this I'm with like take. dive kick though, because the rules of fencing is you just touch them once and you're good. So if we're able to do that, where it's just like I need to run around in world chase tech, but swing a sword well, at you them. Could, you could, you could, you could do it as like boxing rules almost, where instead of like you need to poke them once, instead it's like it's points accumulated for each stat. Ah, I see, I see. I like that instead of talking about video games now, we're spending talking our about the Olympics. Well, no, we're spending our time in between sets discussing how we're going to invent a new, yeah. <laughs> a new how, fictional how you, sport. How do you think that uh, that running was invented? John running was on Melee commentary back in the day and had an idea. <laughs> what if I walk but faster? It's <laughs> a good idea. And I see. Uh, I like that you chose the one thing that's like we've definitely been doing this since humans first existed. Well, that's like that's actually like one of the first.